Have you ever been arrested? <laughs> Not as far as you know. No, you never been. I bet Not you, as far I bet as you know. has been arrested. We'll keep it a mystery. No, no, I'm joking because there's two cops right behind you. I see. So then the question is, have you ever been arrested? Would you like to? Have you ever been arrested? In Would you like to be? My name is T.W. Hawk, and I live in Lisbon. What's that name all about? Typically, people will ask, is it given or chosen? And I say chosen. Words are very powerful, and so our names uh, embody who we are. Stepping into a name like Truth, uh, you know, it's not something you do lightly. This is my book, How to Succeed on Purpose. Modern wisdom and inspirational truth for succeeding every day of your life. You know, come to the determination for oneself about your own truths. That's really what it's about. Let's do it. You're going to pick a card. Oh, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. What do you got? Uh, buffalo. You pulled it upside down too, right? To receive it upside down is a signal you have forgotten to seek help when it's needed. If your hand is closed in a fist, you cannot receive the bounty of abundance. I guess you could say I'm a Hollywood guy. I've been an executive producer of major studio films. I do love storytelling. You made movies. Indeed. Movies like Rounders, 10 Things I Hate About You. 10 Things I Hate About You? 10 Things I Hate About You. What did you do with 10 Things I Hate About You? I was the first person to read the script. I uh, sold it to Disney. I executive produced the movie. Give me three tips to succeeding in Hollywood. I have three F rules for success, and they're very simple, which is follow through, follow up, and get out of your own fucking way. Why do you have all these uh, these notes around the place? They condense or capture principles. I put them up around the house just to give myself inspiration and affirmation. The spontaneous now gives rise to the perpetual. Wow. The right things come to me in the right way at the right time. The gifts of the past become the present of the future. What's your next book gonna be about? It's a sci-fi adventure. Let's just say it's my next big project. Mm -hmm. What's your worst habit? You know, I really just don't think in terms of negatives. That's, that, that, that's truth, truthfully. It's all divine at the end of the day. Tell me this, do you like coffee? I love coffee. Can we go get coffee? Let's Ready? go get coffee. What do you like most about living in Lisbon? The light in the sky, the light in the city, and the light within the people. This is the perfect late afternoon pick-me-up, actually. Do you see yourself staying in Lisbon? Indeed. Yeah, Lisbon is home. The whole city is on the ascension right now, so only more people are going to be attracted here. There's going to be more vibrancy. And yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what the next five years here. Tell me something uh, profound to wrap up this video on. I mean, what's coming in is just the sharing the light within you. That's what we're here for, is sharing our light. We are the people of Lisbon. They are the people of Lisbon. What does that experience make you think about Lisbon? I love the humanity.